Well, this is a cursed tweet, by the way. Seeing Endgame later, my one hope is that Thanos has a full frontal nudity scene, just sunbathing in the quiet of the cosmos, his purple package limp, and his power stones withdrawn as a visual indicator of his doubts regarding the snap. <laughs> I don't know what the snap is, but that's very cursed. <laughs> you don't even know what the snap is. I love it. Welcome back to Sekiro, with me and my wife, Anni. I just spoiled Infinity Wars, the Avengers movie, to Marsh. She didn't know what the snap was. <laughs> um, in the last episode, we fought her dad a little bit, and then explored a lot of the uh, new Ashina Castle. Sort of new, now that it's changed. Hey, that's glowing over there, that box. Oh. Uh, yeah, this episode, we're going to check out that box, apparently. Also, I wanted yeah. to see if I had any upgrades that I can get, and when I walked over here, I noticed Emma is here again, so I wanted to record before we actually interacted with them, just in case something different happens. Hmm. Is that her telling us that we'll never know which place she'll be at, at the castle or here? That probably is. They want to make sure, like, no matter where you go, they're there, so... <laughs> you don't have to hunt them down too much, which is nice of them. Yeah. Yeah, there's no upgrades that I can get and want. There's two that I could get if I had the crafting ingredients, but I've never gotten any of the fulminated mercury that I need. And then there's still the, the send throwing thing that I do not want. <laughs> I'm a day rich now. Yeah. Wait, rich? I'm not rich. I have a thousand coin. Yeah. That's not rich. Rich bitch. Also, I just realized I have a new prosthetic tool to put on. Oh, fuck, right. One that I don't care to use, but, you know. A prosthetic tool created by fitting an indestructible iron-ribbed umbrella to the arm. When spread open, it will protect against attacks from all directions. Oh, that's the point of it. Hmm. Hold it out while moving to protect from light attacks. Well, moving. So if you're moving, it only protects from light attacks? Or I'm not quite sure what that means. But this is an umbrella after all. It won't protect you from low attacks, such as sweep attacks. Oh, maybe it doesn't like slow you down, like blocking dust also. Hmm. Hold right trigger to shelter. Spread the loaded umbrella to guard from attacks in all directions. You can also move with the fan deployed and it will continue to block lighter attacks as you move. Okay, yeah, so it becomes less effective if you move. Oh. And then press right trigger the moment enemy attacks land. Umbrella deflect. Spread the umbrella to deflect enemy attacks. Umbrella deflects are easier to time than sword deflects. Hmm. Okay. Not that I have that much trouble getting deflects when I want, but... Could actually be more useful than I thought. Oh, it'd be easier to see if you have upgrades for that shit. Oh, yes. It just opens up shit up. Yeah. Loaded umbrella magnet. Hmm. When spread open, it will protect against attacks. Uh huh. Has a tempered magnetic shaft that makes it nearly unbreakable. Enemy attacks can be deflected by spinning the open umbrella. Um. Can also. Yeah, the hold is still the same. Right triggers enemy attack lands. Mm. While using shelter, left button as enemy attack lands. Spin the umbrella to deflect enemy attacks. Hmm. I think I see. Oh, okay. So if you want to deflect before, you'd have to just use it at the exact... You'd have to right trigger at the exact moment. Or, you know, pretty close to when an enemy's attacking to deflect. But it sounds like this gives you the option to go into a shelter mode and then wall in shelter mode, do a deflect with it. Just switch between the two. Kind of seamlessly. Oh, okay. I think. Yeah, heck yeah. Oh. What are these? I can get that? What is that thing? Pine resin ember. Oh, I got that from the Mibu village. Oh. I can get both of these. Look at how beautiful this fan gets. Oh. Phoenix's lilac umbrella. A loaded umbrella emblazoned with a purplish blue phoenix. The blessing of the phoenix filled the umbrella, preventing damage from apparition type enemies. Oh. oh. No, 
not super important right now, now that I've killed so many headless, but the next time I encounter one, could be nice. Yeah. And what about this? Okanaga's flame vent. A barrel containing smoldering resin that acts as an explosive catalyst. And it's a short-range flame blast. Continuous fire damage will inflict the burn status. It's able to maintain a continuous stream of flames due to the smoldering resin inside of the tube mechanism. So it's more of a flamethrower, like oh. spraying fire. Hold it to charge up the spring mechanism to release a huge blast of fire before you. Uh, that's not any different, but right. Hold right trigger or no, press right trigger and then hold right trigger for flowing flames. A continuous spray of fire before you. Ooh. Okay, these are cool. Do I have the money bags for this? I need 2,000. You used oh, to be hell rich. Yeah. I totally have the money bags for them. <laughs> I did used to be rich. No, you're just a bitch. Hmm. <laughs> oh shit, that just opened up a bunch of things too. Oh my god. Oh my god, it opened up that entire, like, almost last tier. Oh. <sighs> Uh, the, I think these all probably require special items, like this malcontents ring. Look at that. Damn. Beautiful. I can actually do that if I had the money. Uh, I probably don't have the money for any of these. Maybe one. <laughs> 1,500. They're all about 1,500. I could probably do one. What can I actually do? Not this. That needs mercury. Forget that. You can't even do it anymore because you don't have the ingredients. Yeah. Mm, only this one. The Golden oh. Vortex. Gather a lustrous golden wind and release it to force enemies caught up in the vortex to face the other way. Can be performed twice in a row. Enemies that have been turned around drop items or money to be considered donations. <laughs> <laughs> so wait, is that... Oh, that's why it's gold, I guess, because like, send money. Okay. So is that the only advantage? It just makes them drop shit? <laughs> it's yeah. It's pretty cool. I mean, the other one wouldn't make him drop anything. Yeah, it's called a donation whirl. <laughs> <laughs> Release the winds around an enemy, making them face the opposite direction. They will drop items and sin. Can be released twice. Huh. I mean, that just sounds hilarious. I want that. <laughs> 1,500. Ah, I don't think I can do that. I don't think I have 15 of these. No, I have 11. Okay, it's going to have to wait a little bit. Hey, let's go see what's in the box. What if it's just like a shit ton of money? That'd be nice. Because I need money. You could try selling some of your fistfuls of ash to Fuchioka over there. True. <sighs> what kind of a donation box requires you to pay? It, you have to pay. T it's a donation. You give donations to the box. But then, yeah, that makes sense. But I mean, why do you take something out of a donation box? Whatever. Anyway, technique that serves uh, to, to leap towards the opponent who has exposed himself in midair and strike, killing him before he hits the ground. Oh, I think we've seen this before. Maybe it's an ability I can get or something. Oh yeah. I'll, like oh. spend skill points on. Yeah. So if you hit somebody in midair. You can get a death blow on them. Cool, cool, cool. Would that work with our dad? No. <laughs> Nothing ever works with our dad. Mm. Okay. Let's try these new abilities. Phoenix's Lilac Umbrella. Okanaga's Flame Vent. Just those two, right? Um, no. Also, well, I mean, I guess, yeah. I guess, yeah, because the other one was just a magnetic umbrella. Yeah, I think it's this is just a better version of it. I just sold 50 clumps of ash and then used up almost all of my Litecoin purses to be able to afford the Golden Vortex. Maybe we'll get rich using it. Fuck yeah. Oh, it's going to take both of my lumps of Grave Wax. Those were hard got. I hope it's really good. Oh, maybe they'll drop more than the average enemy. Hmm. I hope so. 
Okay, I'm about to try out the three new prosthetic tools we just got. But before that, let's spend my three skill points on flowing water. Reduces the amount of damage to posture when attacked by an enemy with a sword. So a lot of enemies that I fight have swords, and this is going to be especially good for fighting our dad, too. Because I was having a lot of posture problems. Yeah. Just bad posture, just getting back pain. <laughs> what is this? A sheen across. From a sheathed stance, draw the blade at high speed. Huh. Okay, let's try them all out. Uh, which one first? Golden Vortex? Okay. Ka-ching! Oh! You didn't have to do it twice, even. Nope, you get loot each time. I think, although it only appeared over here. Uh, I really want to get just this one, not the other one, because I want to know how much of this is. Just got to go really far away then, huh? There we go. Nice. <laughs> She's still living. I don't know if this is worth it. You didn't even get an item, even though it looked like there was an item. What? I wonder if you do it with a harder enemy, they'll give you better stuff, though. Probably. There we go. Now, what'd you drop? 73 coin, yes. So harder enemies give you much better stuff. And scrap iron and gogon sugar. Okay, that's pretty good. Let's use another ability. That looks fucking cool. Yeah. So how long does it last for? Jesus Christ, that's good. Wow. Oh, but you're just blocking there. So yeah, you're so not spinning. Yeah. So it's hurting my posture. It's not using up any further emblems. It just continues to work. Nice. Yeah, just when your posture breaks is when it breaks. That's very good. So let me try deflecting. That looks so cool! Well, I can just keep doing it. I thought it was like one time. No, oh, that uses, uses emblems. emblems. <gasps> oh, my bad. That is so cool looking. Alright, let's try this on blue dudes. Do I have to hold it down or... Do yeah, I have to hold it down. I'm not sure if the deflect is really, like, worth it? Yeah. It's cool looking, but, like, why not just do a normal deflect? Yeah. Let's try Okanaga's Flame Vent. Did that... So that's the same as the other one? Oh, well, that kept burning. Surprisingly, it didn't stop them. Yeah. Somebody call 911. Shot his fire burning on the dance floor. Whoa. It also uses a lot of emblems. Yeah. I don't think the straight damage that it does is, like, worth it. I think oh. it's more useful for, like, if you just need to hit them a bit more to make them catch on fire in the first place. Yeah, I think that's, like, something that maybe is only useful against some, like, red eyes. I want to try something about the mortal draw. No, not mortal draw. Uh, Shadow Rush. I noticed that it says... Um, leaping in the air costs spirit emblems. And I didn't really understand what that meant. But I think what it's saying is you don't leap into the air if you don't make contact with an enemy. And it's only leaping into the air that costs spirit emblems. So I think it's saying that if you just don't... You know, if it doesn't work, if it doesn't hit an enemy, you don't pay anything. Oh. I think. So. Yeah. Yeah, if it doesn't make contact with an enemy, you don't leap into the air, and it doesn't cost anything. But if you do... Not a lot of headroom here, but... There we go. So it's just a little Sonic thing. 
you want to think you were Sonic. Yeah, go fast. Alright, let's head over towards the Serpent Shrine. Might be a good opportunity for money. Oh. They didn't drop any more homophobic. Oh, maybe they only drop once? Yeah. To stop you from, like, farming? Yeah. Okay. Oh, shit, I'm out. Yeah, well, check this out. <laughs> Got front row seats to the fight. This is really such a cool thing. It honestly looks like a hat. Like the same hat that the little assassins use. Mm. <laughs> oh, I didn't mean to use it. Oh, Shadow Rush, no floating passage. Oh. Fucks you up. That's why it's called foot. Because it fucks you up. Good job, friend. Why are you backing away? Monkey's still here? Is this still a monkey way? Oh, that's a good philosophical question. If there is no monkey, is it still some monkey way? No. It's not monkey way anymore. Oh no. I wonder if that person will accept us now. They must have killed all the monkeys. Oh. Oh. That was effective. That was here, go. Oh. Bull Shadow Masanaga the Spear Bear. We didn't kill him, bro. Um, are there any abilities I want to use against them? Uh, can I get a backstab on them? No. <laughs> yeah, I mean burning. It's like, yeah, yeah, all right. Mm. Phantom Kunai could be pretty good. Yeah. And... Spiral Spear? Yeah. Oh, they are also a spear bearer, huh? I mean, we gotta fight on the roof, right? Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. Damn. 
Damn. I tried to Makiri counter it. Well, I mean, I already lost one of my revives, so I'm not going to bother. Like, I was out on a really bad foot here. Yeah. Starting out on a bad foot. I want to see if I can get a uh, backstab off on them before the fight actually starts. Is that another dog? Oh, it's dead. Maybe you need a candy? Yeah. Because I remember they were spotting you earlier. Let's actually just go around this way. Oh, that's rather tall. I see. I see. Damn, I think this is going to work. Oh my god. I was thinking of doing Blood Mist, but I just realized it didn't even give me the option. That's yeah. his way of saying, nah, dude. <laughs> nah, dude. They noped you. Oh, what, did, what candy did they take? Oh, maybe something like that, like damage, just doubles their damage. Oh. Fuck it up. Fuck it up. Uh oh. Did I skip past it? No. No. No! Oh. Damn it. I hate it when I do that. <laughs> they also hate it. They're like, God fucking damn it, do we have to? Whoa. Ooh. Oh. Whoa. That was scary. <laughs> yeah. I don't know if it showed up in the recording, but there was some lag just then in there. Real scary shit. No! No motherfucker! Oof! Was that? Oh. I didn't do enough damage to get another one. Oh, you're doing super good, though, babe. Yeah, that was a really good attempt. All right, let's try this again. Yeah, 
And you know what? Let's take a candy ourselves. Mm. More damage? Yeah. Did you actually take it? No. Oh, shit, did I move too fast? Or... Or what happened there? I don't know. There we go. Do you see me? Yeah. What? <laughs> Fucker. I don't know what that move was that I just did, but it's pretty cool. <laughs> no. Aww. Man, even at half health, their posture restores really quickly. Yeah. Let's try again. <laughs> Fucker. <laughs> I don't want you to carry counter to the leg, because that shit gotta hurt, right? Yeah. Yes! Oh! Ah! Prayer bead! Oh! That was a good fight. Give me your loop before you fall! I got it anyway. I just want them to bend the coins. blood droplet. I guess they're never going to teach us anything now, huh? Maybe. I mean, what if they just went somewhere else? Like, I mean, if they were dead, we would see their body here, right? Are those not... Is it not the person? That person? Oh, I oh. guess not. Is it? I don't know. 
we remember. I don't think so, because it had a mask on. Like a uh, wooden mask with a long nose. Oh, fuck, right, like Dingle. Yeah. Oh, wait, it was Dingle, wasn't it? No, it wasn't. I don't remember. Yeah, 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 it was the Dingle. Or the person who wanted us to call them Dingle. We could try the first place we met them. Do we, we don't have access to that shrine, do we? So now I've got this one. It was the battlefield where we first met, right? Yeah, oh, it was outskirts, wasn't it? Yeah, it was yeah. over here. Uh, yeah, let's go check over here. Duh? Duh? Who's that? Yeah, that's not Dingo, what? Person of many faces. Anda. Nanio あんただって鬼に会いたいわけじゃないかろ。ニビアワード。さあ、あんた。じゃ、エニウェアエルスウィカンルックフォーダム。ギャスナーフォーナウ。I'm <laughs> <laughs> That's so cute. Oh. And what did this do again? Gradually recovers vitality for a time. There were you. Hi. Okome wa daiji. Shikari kande. So, can I say thank you? I guess I kind of already did, but. Just check. No, we're good. Okay. Alright, it's daddy time again.